Alright, uh, today's uh, Monday, September 16th, uh, this came in the mail from UPS away, I had ordered it, I love Breaking Bad, I had to get the Heisenberg statue figure, this uh, figure comes with the, the Heisenberg hat, you get the shades, the bag of money, and the bag of meth, which uh, you can see right there. And he also has the pistol in his hand. Everything. Breaking Bad. I hope they do a whole assembly line for all the characters. I would like to have a Gus Fring at statue figure. That would be amazing. Or Jesse. Or, or Mike. I mean, just make the whole line of figures for the whole show. They also announced... Uh, the collection series that will be $225 sometime uh, this year. Everything comes inside the barrel of money that's in the show. So, uh, I know you all seen the barrels of money and everything. So, uh, that's going to be a really nice collector set. Comes with a lot. Uh, so, if I have extra cash, you can go pre-order it. Pre-orders are going up. Also... I was able to get a Final Fantasy statue thing here. As you can see. I did pick that game up. That This will go well with my collector's edition of Final Fantasy XIV. A Realm Reborn. So it goes perfect. I was able to pick that up. Also, uh, Everything picked up a regular edition of Grand Theft Auto 5 for the Xbox 360, but I also picked up the collector's edition of Grand Theft Auto 5 for the PlayStation 3. So, uh, that was a whole nice stuff. Day here, I mean, as you can see, the Los Santos hat that came with the collector's edition Grand Theft Auto 5. You know, the security bag, everything. You know, this was the case, you know, for the PS3 collector's edition. Put them side by side, you know. As you can see there, you know. Grand Theft Auto 5, two discs for Xbox. No, the other disc is inside my Xbox 360. Uh, I have PlayStation disc inside my PlayStation. No, I'm installing them. So, I uh, also did get the collector's guidebook. As you see here, collector's hardcover guidebook. Limited edition collector's guidebook. Well, came with the exclusive lithograph. As you can see here. But, without further ado, uh, let's get to the unboxing of the Breaking Bad Heisenberg statue figure. I want to open this up very nice and carefully. Really would like to keep this box, you know, display it along with the figure. It's breaking bad. Love the show. I mean, it's just the writing is extremely excellent. As you can see, they also have some uh, other stuff that's coming out. The Walter White Wogglehead and the Assorted Plush Dolls. Let's see, ordered mine from WizToys.com. See, collectibles. Comes with a gym bag with money, hat, and sunglasses. Notice they don't put, say it about the bag of meth. And it comes in here. I guess it wouldn't pass the MS. MRV rating if they were to say the bag of meth. <laughs> so I will show you in a second. Let's open this up here. Let's open. Let's open this without 
missing anything major up on the, the back artwork. Breaking bad. Nope. And mess up too bad there. Let's see, just close it right back. It's almost as good as new. Let's see, as you can see, the bag of meth here. <laughs> Blue crystal meth. See it right there. Notice it wasn't on the package. <laughs> you get his money bag, bag of money. Uh, the strap does not go over these straps here. But it's mostly for him just holding, displaying. It's a statue because it has no articulation whatsoever. As you can see here, the pistol cannot come out of his hand for display use uh, there's some plastic over his face most likely for the hat the hat comes off as you can see here the hat does come off uh, as you can see the figure it's very nice clean not scuffed the detailing his jacket Lining the jacket does not open up. Uh, his feet do not move. Uh, the shades do come off. If uh, we could take this plastic off here, the shades do come off. You have to be very careful. Very, very careful so you don't scuff the figure itself. Do not bend these shades because. They are very flimsy. They can overbend to not fit his face anymore. The face is very detailed. You can look into Walter White's deep evil eyes. You can see all the details on his beard, mustache. See the cradles right in his skull. Very detailed, very nice. The arms do not move. It's for mostly display use, and that's just what I'm gonna do. Uh, you can try. Let's see. Uh, can we get this back in his hand? Let's see here. Him, put the bag of money on the side, have the bag of meth, put it in his hand, or you could just display it down there, have the hat on his head, like on the, uh, nice display piece, we'll go with all my other collection figures. I really hope they make more figures for this assembly line. This will be nice because I really enjoy the show. Will not spoil any parts of the show for anyone. Will not be a jerk like that. <laughs> but as you see, I am going to try to put the meth bag in his hand. His hands are 
not as tight to keep anything in there, but they, it does hold for a little bit, but not really tight. There we go. Bag of meth is in his hand. And you put the bag of money. It's very pure. The best quality that you could get on the streets. This is a very nice statue for display. Especially if you're a fan of the show. I advise you to order them if they ever get any more back in stock. Just remember uh, where to order it from. That's where I ordered it from. The orders were going fast. This retails for $18.99. With your state tax, they're running about $20, $22. Depending on your state tax, it might be even more. I advise you to pick this up. Very nice. Zoom in. Walter Wright, aka Heisenberg. He is the one who knocks. <laughs> See you next time on my unboxing videos.